Hi guys, today we'll be reviewing a brand new Korean skincare called Toridin. So a brief history of this particular skincare product, Toridin was established in South Korea in the year 2015. And ever since then, it's been one of the top selling skincare products in South Korea and we have the opportunity to actually review one of their lines. Now, they have three major different skincare lines and the one that we're reviewing today is their dive-in line. However, before we continue with the rest of the video, guys, I would like you guys to help me to help subscribe to our videos. The reason why I need your help to subscribe to the channel is because we don't accept any sort of paid promotions, neither do we have any ads. So we only get the revenue from our AdSense or from the advertisements shown to you. So you would definitely help the channel out if you help subscribe to the channel and watch our other videos. Great day guys, I'm Dr. Inky, your digital skin doctor and welcome to SkinFix, the platform whereby we do deep dives into skincare products and we cut off all the BS. So for today, we'll be reviewing a skincare product from South Korea called Toridin. And more importantly, we're not going to review all their products. Specifically, we're going to review one line, which is their dive-in line. Now, the Toridin dive-in skincare products have one main function, to hydrate your skin. Now, before we start reviewing their first product, I will need to talk a little bit about hyaluronic acid. Toridin dive-in line contains five different hyaluronic acids. And each of the different hyaluronic acids actually help hydrate different levels or different parts of your skin. So let's talk about the first hyaluronic acid first. The first is sodium hyaluronic. Now, sodium hyaluronic is the largest of all hyaluronic acid molecules. And it's meant to sit on top of your epidermis and to prevent transepidermal water loss. And due to its large molecular size, it can only hydrate the top layers of your skin. The second hyaluronic acid is sodium hyaluronic cross polymer. This is slightly different because the HA molecule form a mesh-like structure. And to give you a brief understanding what a mesh-like structure is, imagine it forms and weaves together as if it's a net. So this particular netting-like structure sits on top of, of your epidermis, locking in the moisture inside your skin and preventing further water loss. The third kind of hyaluronic acid is sodium acetylated hyaluronic. Now this is actually medium molecular weight. It means it goes slightly deeper than the regular HA molecules. Now the fourth one is a low molecular hyaluronic acid. Now this is called hydrolyzed HA or hydrolyzed hyaluronic acid. It means that the large hyaluronic acid molecules are fragmented into smaller portions. Hence, absorption is much easier and it penetrates deeper into your skin. And the fifth one is hydrolyzed sodium hyaluronic, which is a smaller structure of the large HA molecule which is spoke in the first place. Now to make it much easier, I'm gonna lump all of five of these together and call it 5DHA or five different HA. Now throughout the video, I'll be talking about this 5DHA. Now guys, I don't like to waste a lot of your time, so I'm going to review my favorite Toridin products first and then carry on to the ones that I think might be able to help you out. Now the first product that I'm going to review and you might actually benefit a lot from this is the Toridin's Dive-In Serum. Now, the serum contains the 5DHA that we spoke about much, much earlier. It also contains a lot of glycerin. Now, glycerin is an underrated skincare ingredient which helps you moisturize your skin naturally. Now, if you're having a look at the skincare bottle, it's written that low molecular hyaluronic acid with D-pentanol. Now, what is D-pentanol? D-pentanol is vitamin B5. D-pentanol works as an anti-inflammatory and helps speed up wound repair. That means from those who are suffering from acne or acne scars, or even if you have an issue with your skin barrier, pentanol actually increases the rate of your skin's repair. Hence, it closes up those gaps on your skin at a much quicker pace. And another one of my favorite ingredients inside the serum is allantoin. Now, allantoin is a soothing ingredient and it helps soothe sensitive skin. And if that's not enough, it also contains ceramide. Ceramide is a natural form of phospholipid to protect your skin barrier and to close up 
those nasty, small, teeny tiny holes in your epidermal layer. Now the serum doesn't have any added alcohol, it has no fragrance and has no colouring at all. And you realise that all of the Toridan Dive-In products does not contain any of those issues. Now other than pentanol, it also contains other forms of anti-inflammatory ingredients, namely witch hazel extract and centella asiatica. Now, you may, you'll be wondering if it does not contain any form of colouring, now why is the serum slightly bluish hue in colour? And this is because of an extract inside called a malachite extract. Now this is actually a soothing extract which helps soothe your skin. So pair up together with allantoin, it soothes your skin and reduces skin sensitivity. Now, as I'm testing the particular serum, it is noticeable that the serum is very lightweight and very easy to actually apply it on. I'll give you an example, let's try it again. Okay, I'm gonna drop it, I'm gonna drop the serum on my skin and what you notice is it actually flows down from my skin really, really quickly and really, really easily. So this particular serum is great for someone who do not like those heavy sort of serum on your skin and, and for someone with an acne prone skin whereby it's easily clogged. This is because most HA serums only contain one or two different forms of hyaluronic acid and generally it contains the large molecular weight. Hence, most of the HA serums are very heavy in nature and very viscous. This one on the other hand, because it contains a lot of low molecular weight HA, it absorbs much quicker on your skin and it doesn't feel as heavy. Now who can actually use this particular product? It is great for all skin types. It doesn't matter if you have oily skin, acne prone skin, combination skin, if you have dry skin, or even if you have sensitive skin. It works for everyone. Now I highly recommend their particular serum. Now before we continue, are you suffering from dry or dehydrated skin? Let us know in the comments below what skincare products that you are currently using. Now the second product in their line which I really like is a Dive In Soothing Cream. Now this particular cream contains 100 ml, so it's 100 ml of moisturizer and it looks really really nice. Now because it's a soothing cream, it contains chock full and a lot of soothing ingredients inside. It contains allantoin, witch hazel extract and at the same time, pentanol. However, one of the star ingredients inside is turmeric extract. Now, turmeric extract is an anti-inflammatory and a soothing ingredient and it helps reduce redness over your skin. Turmeric also has an added benefit. It is a skin brightener. Now, a lot of people with very sensitive form of skin can't use things with high doses of kojic acid or vitamin C which are great skin brighteners. So if you're looking for a skin brightening ingredient to replace the more acidic form of skin brightener ingredients, now, turmeric is actually a very good replacement. It also has antioxidants like chamomile extract and the malachite extract as well. That means that it is also slightly bluish hue in color. And not to forget that it also contains 5-DHA for hydration. Now first of all, let's have a look at its texture. It has this particular gel-like texture. It's very water-based, so when you're applying on your skin, when you're applying on your skin, it does not feel heavy. Now, sometimes when you have a very acne-prone skin or very oily skin, and you apply a very heavy kind of cream, now it might feel a little bit uncomfortable. And one of the great issues is, if you're using this sort of soothing cream, this sort of particular gel-like texture kind of cream and you're applying a makeup on over the top, you do not get that particular peeling issue. Now, the peeling that we're talking about is P-I-L-I-N-G whereby you have this whitish sort of flakiness that appears on your skin. Now, who can actually use this particular soothing cream? Well, if you have sensitive skin, acne prone skin, oily skin, normal skin, dry skin, it is suitable for all skin types. Now, this I would actually like and I would actually use it on a daily basis. However, if you're looking for a more thicker kind of moisturizer, now they do have one. This is the Dive In Cream. Now the Dive In Cream contains low molecular HA along with something called Oligopeptide 1. Now what is Oligopeptide 1? Oligopeptide 1 is a form of epidermal growth factor or in short EGF. Now EGF 
is available already in you naturally. And it's a signal messenger that tells your skin to improve hydration, to repair itself really quickly, and at the same time, it can even reduce hyperpigmentation. EGF is one of the latest form of skincare ingredient technology for anti-aging and for self-repair. Now this particular cream contains something called a Babaris vulgaris root extract. Now this particular extract is an antibacterial form of skincare ingredient. It means it helps reduce bacteria on your skin, namely if you're suffering from acne. At the same time, it contains other ingredients found in the other dive-in products, which are Allentoin, Panthenol, 5-DHA. It contains as well a lot of hydration. This particular cream also contains ceramide. So if you're suffering from a thinning skin barrier, the EGF and the ceramide itself will help strengthen your skin barrier. Now the texture itself, it's slightly different than a soothing cream. Now, the texture itself is slightly creamier. Now, even though it's slightly creamier, it is not really that heavy on your skin. So it's easy to actually smoothen it around and to apply it. And just like the soothing cream, if you're someone that wears makeup over the top of your moisturizer, it does not have any peeling effect. However, this particular cream is more suited towards someone with a dry skin or if you're suffering from a skin barrier issue, namely issues with eczema, issues with psoriasis, this would actually make a very good moisturizer for your daily needs. Now those three are my favorite products from the Toridan Dive In range. Now, however, they do have other forms of products as well. Now introducing the Dive In Foam Cleanser. This is also a sub-acid cleanser. Now a sub-acid cleanser in short means that it has a pH of 5.5 very similar to your skin's natural pH. Within the cleanser, it contains sea salt extract. Now the sea salt extract, what it does is it actually helps exfoliate your skin much deeper. At the same time, contains antibacterial properties. So if you have a very sensitive kind of acne issue, this would be a very good cleanser for you to try. Now because this particular cleanser doesn't contain SLS, it requires a surfactant to be able to extract all, to, all the excessive sebum from your skin. So what they have used is they have used something called a coconut surfactant. So using a coconut surfactant, they'll be able to remove excessive oil from your skin without over drying your skin. At the same time, it also helps hydrate your skin. Cleansers rarely have hydrating ingredients, whereas in this particular cleanser, it contains the 5-DHA at the same time, it contains ceramide. Now, as ceramide is a really expensive ingredient, this particular cleanser is actually affordable. And as usual, like all the other dive-in products, it contains allantoin, contains pantanol, and contains other sort of soothing ingredients inside as well. Now, let's have a look at its texture. Now, the texture itself, it's slightly creamy in nature. Now, as you add water and you're cleaning your face, what you notice is there's very minimal foaming. And the reason why there's very minimal foaming is because there is no SLS, there's no SLE added inside. Hence, that's why there is no foaming uh, bubbles coming out. Now, even though there's no foaming bubbles coming out, it does not mean it's not cleaning your face. It actually cleans your face really, really well. So now, if you're planning to use this particular cleanser, who is it suitable for then? Now, generally, it's more suitable for someone with a dry skin and someone with sensitive skin. However, if you're suffering from dehydrated acne skin, that means your skin is dry, but at the same time it's acne prone, then you might want to use this cleanser once a day. At the same time, if you have sensitive skin, and you're unsure whether you want to use the products or not, it actually contains a list of stuff it does not contain. Example, it says no mineral oil, no SLS, no sorbic acid, no colorant, no fragrance. Are you a big fan of K-beauty products like Toridin? Let us know in the comments below what other K-beauty products that you like and you would like us to review in the future. The next product that you might want to look into is the Dive In Skin Booster. Now, Dive In Skin Booster comes in a 200 ml packaging. Now, one of the key ingredients in a skin booster is an ingredient called phytosphingosin. 
Now this is a natural occurring oil or lipid on your skin and it contains antibacterial properties. So this particular skin booster, it's meant to mimic your skin's own sebum at the same time help control the amount of bacteria that proliferates on your skin. The skin booster itself contains soothing ingredients like allantoin, pantanol and witch hazel extract and also contains that 5-DHA we spoke about earlier. Now the skin booster itself feels like a serum. Now, just for demonstration purposes, this is what it looks like. Now, it's quite aqueous. That means that it contains a lot of low molecular weight HA. However, it feels slightly heavier than the serum, the dive-in serum which we spoke about earlier. That means for those who do not like the lightweight kind of serum feeling, this is slightly heavier weight. It means that you will feel it sit on your skin for a slightly longer period of time. And the particular bluish hue that you see is due to the malachite extract which is available in all the dive-in products. Now, who is this suitable for? This is more towards someone with sensitive skin and someone with really dry skin. That means if you have dry skin, one of the main products that you want to look for is a product that can then sit on your skin for a slightly longer period of time because this will actually not only hydrate your skin but prevent additional transepidermal water loss. Now, let's say you're someone that do not like to use essence or serums on your skin. Maybe you don't like that particular liquid kind of feeling on your skin. But you want to still hydrate your skin. Now, you might want to look at this. This is the Toridan Dive In Multi Pads. Now, each particular packaging inside contains eight small cotton pads. It contains some of the ingredients similar to the Dive In Soothing Cream, namely turmeric extract, which we mentioned earlier, great anti-inflammatory and helps brighten your skin. At the same time, it also contains caffeine. Now, caffeine helps regulate microcirculations around your skin. So it helps with fine veins and because of that, it helps reduce the eye circles and puffy eyes. So if you're, if you're looking for a product that not only helps your skin, but help reduce your puffy eyes and dark eye circles, you might want to try this particular pad. Now, the pad itself also contains the 5-DHA, contains allantoin, contains pantanol as well. So the pad is great for someone with a tired, more fatigued skin. It means your skin looks old, you know, your skin looks aging, but at the same time, you do not want to use too much of a heavy essence or a heavy serum. You can actually use this once or twice a day before your moisturizer. This is great for someone with dry skin, sensitive skin, at the same time, if you're suffering from eye bags or puffy eyes. And as always, if you're talking about South Korean products or K-Beauty, you must talk about their sheet mask. Now, each box of sheet mask contains 10 pieces. Now, this particular mask has the same ingredients as the dive-in serum. It means it contains pentanol, allantoin, it also contains the 5-DHA but they've added something inside. It contains turmeric extract and that helps for skin brightening. So if you have sensitive skin, but you still want to brighten your skin, you can actually use this mask on a daily basis. It is made from 100% cellulose material. That means it's biodegradable, it breaks down. At the same time, it holds in a lot of essence or serum in the mask. Now, if you're someone that likes masking, you might like this particular mask. Now they have very, a very interesting packaging. First of all, this is the first time I've ever seen a mask that uses transparent packaging. That means you can actually see, if you hold it at the light, you can actually see through the entire package. So in terms of packaging, I really like this. Now, if you're interested in masking using this, you know, one of the best ways to use it before is before you put the mask on, you should squeeze a little bit of the mask to make sure the essence or the serum is distributed throughout the mask. Then what you do is you remove it and place it on your face for 15 to 20 minutes. And after the time is up, remove the mask, don't wash your face and apply one of their moisturizer or the moisturizer of your choice. Now, who is suitable to use the mask? Someone with sensitive skin and if you have sensitive skin or eczema prone skin and you've always been trying to find a particular sheet mask that is suitable for you, you can definitely try this out. At the same time, if you have dehydrated or dry skin, you can use the mask on a daily basis. 
All right, guys, that's the end of our video. Let us know what you think of a Toridan dive in product line. If you haven't done so, please click the subscribe button, turn on the bell button because we release new videos on a daily basis. And at the same time, let us know in the comments below what you like and dislike about the Toridan dive in product. Until next time, I'm Dr. Inky, and always remember to stay safe, stay healthy, and most importantly, stay informed. Are you tired of wasting time and money on your skin, but nothing works? We are here to help. SkinFix is a platform that provides personal care education completely free. SkinFix is run by skin doctors and skincare experts. You can chat and consult with our skin doctors without ever leaving your home. Other than free advice, SkinFix also provides tailor-made solutions for your skin problem with customized medical-grade skincare delivered right to your doorstep. SkinFix, your digital skin doctor.